Hey guys, how you doing? Uh, Dave here. Every time I go into the grocery store, I buy these chocolate Swiss rolls. I'm just obsessed with them. And I thought, it's one of my favorite cakes, so I'm going to try and recreate it. I did it, and we made it so easy for you, and it came out so great. You're going to love it, so let me walk you through this. First off, what I'm going to do is spray a baking pan with some baking spray. And this is like 15 by 11. Line it with some parchment paper. And we're just going to set this aside. So what we're going to do now is add four eggs into a bowl, two-thirds of a cup of white granulated sugar, and we're going to beat this up until it's kind of yellow and foamy. Now it's nice and yellow and foamy. I'm going to add in two tablespoons of vegetable oil, and go ahead and mix this until it's well incorporated. Sift in half a cup of flour, a quarter cup of cocoa, a teaspoon of baking powder, and a pinch of salt just to bring out those flavors. So we'll just go ahead and sift this in. Now we're just going to go ahead and give this a mix until everything is well incorporated. Pour our mixture into the pan. <laughs> this is going to be so good. Just kind of give it a swirl around so you get a nice even distribution. Yeah, something like this. That's about perfect. And we're going to slip this into a 350 degree Fahrenheit, 177 Celsius oven for about 12 minutes. After about 12 minutes, it's baked nicely and we're just going to slip this onto a damp cloth. Just kind of grab it and slide it out of the tray onto the damp cloth. While it's hot, I'm just going to kind of grab up the end and roll it up. Something like this. Now what we're going to do is just let this cool completely. So while the cake is cooling, we're going to make the filling by combining a cup and a half of heavy whipping cream. And this is about 30% fat, 35 actually. So I'm just going to add, I've got a quarter cup of sugar here, and, and gradually add the sugar just a little bit at a time. After three or four minutes, you're going to get a peak something like this, and this is just about perfect. So what I've got here is a quarter of a cup of melted chocolate that I've nuked. You can do it in a double, bro double broiler as well. And I'm just going to add this to the mixture. Grab up my spatula and fold everything together until it's nicely combined. Oh, doesn't this look incredible? Something like this. And of course, if you want more chocolate, you can go ahead and add as much as you like. Okay, guys, now our roll is cooled completely. We're going to go ahead and unroll it. Take our mixture and just kind of spread it evenly over the top. Look at this. Then what we're going to do is grab up one end and just kind of do a re-roll on it. <laughs> this is going to be so good. Mm-mm. Just check this out, guys. So we're going to set our Swiss roll in the fridge for about an hour to set. Give this a slice. And there you have it, our chocolate Swiss roll. Absolute yummy goodness.